Hello there to all those people who are watching this video. I'm shooting in Plymouth, UK. The time is 5 past 7 a.m. on the 18th of August 2012. As you can see, the sky has been, for want of a better word, completely destroyed, covered in a chemical haze called chemtrails. Now for all those who don't know, a chemtrail is an exhaust that comes out of a plane that doesn't dissipate, stays for hours, forms this milky residue as we can see above, and covers the sky in various chemicals, of which we have been made aware by others contain barium, strontium, arsenic, aluminium in the size of nanoparticles and uh, various live microfibers. So I'm shooting this video to show you this is what they do above Plymouth at this present time. Usually when we forecast for a beautiful blue and sunny day they will cover the sky in this. I don't know if you can see that while I'm panning across now. I'll show you the ones mixed in with the clouds. And as I pan around you can see others here that are blending into clouds and covering what was supposed to be a lovely blue and sunny day down here in Devon. Now, the reasons they're doing this are unclear, whether it's weather modification, whether it's depopulation, nobody's quite sure. But we do know for sure that they're doing this. This up here is unnatural. Plymouth is not on a main flight path. So how, how come this time of the morning so early there are so many flights on a Saturday? Well, I can't really answer that because as far as my flight tracker is concerned on the uh, internet that tracks commercial flights, there are no planes anywhere near the Plymouth area. Oh, I'm 99% sure that I can't see any, especially these are commercial flights. Uh, military flights I don't know. As you can see over there, there's more spraying. Uh, as I look into the distance, you can see another trail that's uh, crossing the sky. And behind the trees, quite clearly, there is more aerial activity base. This is a shot right over the centre of Plymouth City. If I pan in, you can see that quite clearly uh, and there's a new one being made as I speak so there you have the flight paths of four aircraft that don't commercially exist on the flight tracker all going in various directions so I ask you now to please please spread the word tell your friends Tell your neighbours, especially tell the politicians from your area, write to your Prime Minister if you so feel, or your President, ask them what is actually happening in the sky, as I did with uh, David Cameron uh, and his assistant Liz Suggs, his uh, Chief or Head of Operations. Uh, through this video I would like to say to her and to him tell me what the answer is, what you're actually doing to the sky, you know, the people of this world have a right to know. We breathe the air, we eat the food, we drink the water, and as far as I and a lot of others are aware, you are contaminating this, so we demand answers, and we demand answers now. So publish and tell us, give us a chance to actually understand what you're doing and then maybe perhaps maybe yeah we'll believe you but being politicians we're not sure so I leave you with this shot uh, above the centre of Plymouth that contains the very very nasty chemicals that have been sprayed in the sky above Plymouth thank you for your time